think the one-day cup officially is said to have started in 2014 in the current format, but I sort of feel it's, in a way, mm. it started in 2021, this particular format. As that one, uh, it tries to turn around his pads, doesn't get hold of it, and comes off the glove and rolls away. It was, of course, in 2021. Probably it's something teams are beginning to work out oh, now. As yeah. Roderick is out, caught at slip, low down to his right, good low catch. Um, his, there isn't a lot of it, is there? As Pollock drives <coughs> Barnard back over his head. Um, that will go all the way for four to the biggest end. Didn't absolutely middle it, Pollock, but he's gone for the big drive on the up, straight back over the bowler's head. Young players involved. Alan Dolby balls. That's Edgeton Court. And Alan Dolby gets Jones out, and Rob Yates takes his second catch, just moving to his right. And it was about stomach height when it reached him. Balls again, and uh, he swivels round Pollock and contains himself a little bit, just uh, doesn't give it the full pull shot, but gets it out into the deep for a single. And then Dolby bowls, and that's beaten. Has he got an edge? She has. And Libby's gone second ball, and Hannon Dolby strikes again. He's caught behind by Michael Burgess. Uh, and Worcestershire have, I'm sorry to say, lost four wickets. Uh, I was going to say three, but we've just seen another one as Barnard. Because it was a last ball and over, so Cox is the non strikers there. And the new battle oh, goes for a big shot there. And it doesn't bounce as high as he expected. Cassiavalli gets a bottom edge onto his body. Birmingham Phoenix and the Oval Invincibles. That was hit. Oh, that's a big shot from uh, Cassie Valley. He's got hold of that, and that is the first six of the match. Last over of the power play as Barnard is in, and Cassie's on the walk and uh, looking to fend this one away on the leg side, and is uh, out, given out. Didn't like it. I think he must have got a glove on it. And Michael Burgess diving to his left takes a good low catch. Match ups, as they now say. Alan Dolby bowls. That's clipped away nicely in the air, but safely. That will be a four. Whether it was because it was a bit leg sideish. Mm. Anyway, Barnard bowls. Weight is forward. Pushes out. Booth again is in. Ball. And well, that slip was nearly in action. That was a good delivery from Booth. It hurried way outside edge. Flew past the diving Rob Yates. Well, it's been really tough work for the Worcestershire batsmen this morning after they lost the toss and were put into bat. Ollie Hannandell starts a new over from the Diglis end and uh, wait, works this one away through mid-wicket for a couple of runs. In fact, it's gone all the way for four. That's the timing that I was talking about before. Beautifully tough. As Booth comes in again and bowls and that's short and he's cut and he's out. Caught by Rob Yates at slip high above his head. Ben Cox may be a little bit discomforted by the ball before. Craig Miles from the New Road End bowls to Matthew Waite, who drives beautifully through mid wicket. Again, he's timed that so well. It's raced away for four. Waite goes to 26. Paul Felton, um, and I, I owe a lot to them for that. Booth again is in, bowls, and that's nicely played by. Wait, swivelling around and pulling that behind square. Two fours on the leg side boundary, one at backward square, one at long leg. It bisects them perfectly. We'll have a change at the end of this over. We'll get Clive Eakin to come back in and uh, have a little bit of a chat. And you can stick around for a bit, Charlie, and have a chat with him. That'd be great. This one tickled down to fine leg, and it's gone for four. It's a full toss from Lintop. To bowl again. And all that one leaps up in the air, that'll be out. He hits on the shoulder of the bat and balloons up to Ed Barnard at backward point. And then Dolby. Ball's bowling! And uh, well, that might have kept a bit low and Waits' very good innings has come to an end. He's out for 44. Only batter really to offer any sustained resistance. But, all right. That one came a bit low on him, do you think, Charlie? Yeah, it, was, it looked uh, certainly full of length, but um, seemed to just skip through. But we'll see what happens if another wicket falls. Here's Alan Dolby. The ball to Baker. That's him on the pass. He's got an LBW. Alan Dolby's on a hat trick and he's got a fifer. And it's 97 for nine.
Well, here he comes, and Oli Hanagobi looking for the hat trick balls to Pennington, who plays it really well, actually, off his toes. And the home crowd cheer, because that may well go all the way. Two fielders are chasing it, but it does uh, go over the ropes. So, very well play Pennington. Uh, he's also brought up the 100 for uh, Worcestershire, though, 101 for 9. And Josh Baker, first ball. As Miles bowls, and Leach slams this up to uh, long on. If you know your new road, he's whacked that towards the old scoreboard. Looks a play a couple of shots and that's uh, Stumpy, he's stumped and uh, I'm not sure whether that was a wide I didn't see the umpire signal but it was uh, leg side-ish anyway and playing forward to that paint and missed it this next one was okay, kept low, it's come off an inside edge, he's going to get four runs down there to fine leg but that one kept very low and just underlines how difficult this could be for the batters and what should we just thinking if we had here's Leach once more this time to Barnard and Barnard is cutting that one and it's one bounce for four. Pennington came round to his right, uh, wasn't able to uh, collect the ball and um, Pennington bowls and that's uh, driven onto the offside and it's uh, got past the field, field, a bit of a misfield uncharacteristically from Libby, should have stopped that, didn't and it's gone through for four for Rob Yates. 22 years of age? Yeah. Are you coming in for me, Frank? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, I was going to do this over, then I've got to go and do a piece. Uh, that one is hit, oh, that's a good shot uh, from Yates. It's into the ground, through the covers for four. It's a little bit of width given to him by Pennington. Fine shot from uh, Rob Yates. Oh, it's yeah. going to be difficult. His weight again bowls. Rob Yates plays a nice shot here off the back foot, steered away. Really a cut shot, sort of square drive off the back foot, slightly angled back, timed it beautifully have been doing well in this competition I think it speaks volumes for the sort of cohesiveness of the yeah. of the squad and so on Van Beek again short that beautifully pulled by Barnard it was a bit of a long hop to be fair and he's just swivelled round on it and pulled it away behind square down to the chestnut tree down Van Beek in again bowls and Barnard clips this one away on the leg side in the air and it's dropped just short of uh, the fielder on the boundary go yeah, it's one of those days. Van Beek again, short. Barnard again, hammers this away on the leg side. So another one bounce four behind square. So Van Beek trying the short. I've been on the wrong end of a couple of those. A bit like that this morning's weight. Bowls, Barnard cuts for six. Over Pennington at third man. Ball landing in the seats down below us. Could see what Matthew Waite was trying to do. 26 off 43. And uh, Matthew Waite... Thinks we'll try another short one. Barnard was expecting it, sitting on the back foot, slaps it away through, mid on for four more. Wait again from the Diglis end, ball short again, and Barnard is again smashing this one away on the leg side for four more. So maybe Matthew Wait uh, just overdoing the short one a bit there. Barnard goes to 50 off 35 ball, and he's put a lie to the old saying that there's no such thing as a free lunch. As uh, Baker bowls a big full toss, which is slapped away by Rob Yates. Describe Baker bowling, and that's uh, paid into the ground to point. There's a shy at the stumps, which hits and goes away for four, four overthrows. That's uh, a bit unfortunate. Well, very unfortunate. But it's four runs onto the total. Um, and that next one from Barnard is slapped through the covers. He's going to get four for that. And he moves on to 61, 101 without loss. 103 without loss. In comes Baker. Round the wicket. Is there a pity for LBW? He's got him. So a bit of success for Baker. Slight ironic cheers from the crowd, but he's got Yates LBW. Baker comes into bowl. And that's hit over the top for four runs. Uh, uh, so this one is Paul in the air just beyond the reach of the field at mid wicket and Ed Barnard wraps the game up with a four uh, he finishes 65 not out and Warwick